back to my channel. I am, I am sick today. I'm sick. Like, I don't know. But, um, I just want to let you guys know that it's official. We are going to sack this month. Mm -hmm. They finally approved my husband's leave, so. I'm excited. <laughs> we just had our little breakfast. I don't know. We ate actual food, not breakfast, though. Because, you know, we always eat leftovers from yesterday. It's like last night's dinner. So. We had some pechuga panizada con sopa con crema. Oh, my God, dude, that's hella annoying. <laughs> <laughs> we finally got, we've been, like, shopping a lot. My husband finally got his bonus. Um, We got, like, we finally got a mattress. We got a table, which we didn't have. We got like a lot of stuff. We, he got a new TV. He got a game thing. I don't know. He always wants to buy new game console thingies. Um, he we've been getting like our house together a little, a little by little. I mean, it's still not perfect. It's not like shit don't match in here. This house is like super random. Like we have like black or brown um, table, and then we have like a like very like I don't know. It's like different colors. All right, I don't know. Like, we went, like, we had dinner at one of his buddies' um, house, I think it was, like, Saturday. And then, like, their house was super cute. It was super nice. Like, their whole house matched. I thought that was so cute. I was like, dang. That was super cute. I love their house. But, um, yeah. <sighs> I'm excited. We're living, like, on the, t somewhere in between the 20s of this month. Um, I'm gonna start packing my bags. Probably, like, I'm gonna start slowly. We've been, um, buying heck of gifts, too. Like, we already have, like, most of all the gifts that we planned on getting. We just need, like, a couple more people. We need, like, four or five people more. That's it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> um, yeah. So, we're gonna go. Um, I told him to invite people over on Saturday. Like, I'm gonna cook some dinner Saturday. I think I'm gonna just make some flautas. Because that's easy and quick and delicious. So, <coughs> Me. Yeah, so that's what's gonna happen. I might give a little house tour once we already re like return our, all the stuff that it's not ours because we still have like a playpen that's still sitting out there. It's been like so much has been like changing in this house. Um, we finally took him out of our room. He has his own room like set up already like somewhat. Um, we took uh, the old TV that was in the living room. We took it to his room, so he has a TV in there. We need to get a stand because it's still on the floor. His TV's still on the floor, but. Uh, <laughs> Our room has a stand already, so our TV is like no longer on the floor. Um, but like I said, his TV is on the floor, so we're we're like um, hoping next next um, we're gonna get his room better, like more set up. Uh, we wanna get like a what do you call it? A little box for the toys or whatever, because um, he has another playpen. Like one, remember the blue one that we bought at the yard sale or whatever? Yeah, that's the one that he has his um, in his room, and we threw some of the toys in there but it's still like I don't want it in there I want to take it out but I want to get like a toy box or whatever that's called so hopefully yeah I want I want to fix his room heck of nice like last night was his first night sleeping in his room by himself he did okay like I was hella scared I was like dog like I, I don't know dude like I've been hella traumatized about infant death and shit but I'm like lord please you know protect him or whatever but I be hella tripping over that. I, like, I, I don't know. And then last night, I, I drank some NyQuil. <laughs> Let me tell you, that was the best night of sleep I've ever had in my whole, in this whole past two years. Since I was pregnant with him, and then after, you know, he's been here for a year already or whatever. Let me tell you, I had the best night's sleep last night. Like, that NyQuil knocked me out. Like, I was gone out of this world. Like, uh-uh. In the morning, he woke up. He usually wakes up around, like, 7 30 ish and um i heard like I, I usually just wake up automatically at that time and then but i could be trying to go back to sleep and stuff but i can't like it's impossible for me to go back to sleep. unless like everything's completely quiet but since he woke up he was like already screaming for somebody to go get him out his crib so his dad went like his dad got here and then um he's gonna go get in the shower he heard him cry he went to go get him and then he brought him to my bed I was like oh from that moment on, it was over. <laughs> yeah. We just had some my wife on my gun. He has like all over his sweater. It's not gonna come off anymore. 
he's been growing so much like he's um i still let him wear like some pants from like size 12 months or whatever but lately he's just been like high water pants for him like they're they too short for him now but then like 18 months are too long so i don't know i'm confused but I mean, obviously, I'm gonna start taking out all the 12 months out and then just like donating them or to throwing them in the trash because I don't know. Sometimes they're he like wearing them off like too much, like they're stink. Oh, let me tell you guys about this incident we I had. I think I don't know, dude. Like right now, my marriage is like at you know we're starting or whatever. We finally get to live together like real life together, like my with my husband. Not like childish thing. Like, I don't know. We used to live with, like, when we first got together or whatever. <coughs> Excuse me. We used to live at his parents, like, his mom's house. So, it wasn't, like, really, like, living alone, you know? Like, I don't know. It wasn't. So, we're finally, like, living together like a real, like, I don't know. Like, a, we're having to take care of business and stuff, you know? We have, we get, we have to get stuff done. So, um, I don't know, like, we're at the point, like, this is just the beginning. We're trying to get used to each other. Dude, we get on each other's nerves so bad. Like, he doesn't, like, okay, see, he wants to play video games. I want to go to the store. Or, you know, I want to go shopping. He hates shopping. I hate when he plays video games. Like, I don't know, it's just arguments. And it's, like, stupid because we argue, like, for, like, let's say 10 minutes. But two minutes later, we're completely okay. Oh. Hi, Dios. No, but yeah, like, and then, like, whatever. So, the whole point is, dude, like, he made me so mad. I think it was, when was last Saturday, I mean? He made me so mad, dude. Tell me why I kicked the fucking hole in the wall. I don't know, okay? I don't know why I thought that was a good idea to kick the fucking wall when this is not my house. So, whatever. I kicked, I was, like, so mad. Like, I don't know what happened. Like, I just fucking felt the urge to kick something. So, I kicked the wall, Okay? Tell me why my foot went through the fucking wall. I was like, fuck. I instantly regretted it, okay? At the moment I see my foot in the wall, I was like, oh. I was so scared, dude. I thought he was going to get, like, mad. But he, he said, like, he was like, what, like, what is wrong with you? Why would you do that? And I was like, I don't know. Because you made me mad. Like, he really did make me mad. So I was like, oh, shit. Like, you know. I didn't say nothing. Because I didn't want to, like, like, you know, but, like, I was like, whatever. But I remember inside of me, I was like, fuck. How am I going to fix that? What am I going to do? <laughs> what am I going to do? <clears throat> so I started searching on YouTube how to fix a, a, a hole in the wall or whatever. And they're trying to, like, I've seen a couple videos. And they're trying to make it, like, I don't know. They're trying to make too much work. I was like, mm-mm, mm, -mm, mm, -mm. I was like, okay, I'll, I'll figure it out. I was even, because this is a rent, like, a house that we rented, right? I was thinking, like, fuck. Like, what if, like, I was just thinking, shit, like, how can I fix this fucking hole in the wall? So whatever, I was just thinking and thinking and thinking and thinking and thinking. Like, what can I really do to fix it? And there was really nothing I could do because I didn't want it to look hella ugly and just like a fucking patch right there. But whatever, I was like, what if I call the fucking, like the rental people or whatever? Like, because they have like, they said like, if you need anything, like assistance or whatever, like they'll come fix anything. Like if the, your sink is already clogged, they'll come in like, um, fix it or whatever. like whatever. I was like, what if I say that we were trying to move something in and then it accidentally like, you know It hit the wall, but obviously I know I was like that's hella stupid like no everybody knows like a hole is made on the wall not like it was a big hole it was like Like probably like, well, obviously it was like the size of my fucking foot like like this much went in there so <laughs> Bless you, Papa. But yeah, so whatever I was like, I, I, we have a little couch in the very entrance, and then I just went and lay there, I just thinking, like, what can I do, what can I do? Finally, he came downstairs, and then he was like, uh, I don't know what he was thinking, honestly, but, um, he, whatever, he came, and then would just talked to me, he's like, I already bought the stuff, so we could fix it Monday, you want to help me fix it Monday? But I was a butthole, dude, I was like, no, I don't want to fix it, but deep in my heart, I was like, man, like, I feel hella bad that I did that, like, I don't even know why I did that. But, um, shoot, he made me mad, and I feel like the urge to break something. I don't know why, because this is not my house, and it's not okay for me to do that, but I still did it anyway, so. <laughs> yeah, anyway, I'm going to show you guys, I'm going to put a clip of when he was, um, sealing the hole or whatever.
I think you shouldn't have done all the way up here though, because you could. Let me clean the little part off now. Or what do you think? Oh, it's drying out. That part's still wet. With this look, so you don't have to. Okay. Okay? Oh, well, I don't know. No, there's no, I don't know. You're gonna do it. Like, it's gonna, no, it's gonna be, like, even, though, like, it's not gonna be, like, sticking out like this one. You have to sand it down. You could probably come with, like, this. The... No, it's not making any better. I think if we do it with our fingers. No. Okay, it's kind of making it come. Anyway, yeah, you have to sand it after. And then, yeah. I think that looks good right there. I think you shouldn't put any more holes in that walls. I think you shouldn't make any That's not an excuse. Uh, I'll do a house tour probably sometime next week. And I'll show you guys what my house is looking like right now. We're still not done. We still want to do like get more stuff and, and stuff. But since um, we are going to sack, we rather like save some of the money that we have for now. So uh, we have money to spend over there too. And yeah. Yeah, that's about it you guys. I don't know why. Really haven't been recording videos because I don't even like know what to really do. I don't know, like, and I've been like feeling sick, and I've been trying to put shit together, you know, like in the house. Eh. But yeah, yeah, that's it for this video, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this little story update, everything. I don't know what this is. Is it an update or a story? It's kind of like a story, huh? And house update. Yeah, this is a house update. And letting you guys know that we are going to stack. So I'm about to pack my bags probably. So I'm going to start probably either today or tomorrow. Um, On Saturday, I say we're going to have people over. So I'm trying to get that ready too. But yeah. And that's it, that's it, that's it. I'm ready, I'm excited. Uh, I'm happy of the way, like, things are coming, you know, together right now. Yes! Uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay! No, but, um, and also, like, <clears throat> as soon as we come back, I'm gonna start looking for, get puppy! Uh-huh, uh-huh. But, um, I'm gonna start getting, looking for a job. Que pues? Like, I really wanna work at the daycare, dude, because, I don't know, I heard that they pay really good. Like, they really have, like, good-ass pay right there. And then they have, like, que puppy! Que? Um, so yeah, hopefully I can get the job there because I really want to work there because that would be awesome, you know. It'll be like, I don't have to take my, drop him off at daycare and then go work over here. No, either, like, we both just go there and then we're going to, either, like, if my husband gets, like, because I guess they have, like, two different shifts. I'm not sure, okay. This is what I just heard. But, um, I guess they, they either start in the morning, like, early, like, as soon as they open, like, at 5 in the morning. And then it's an eight-hour shift, whatever. And then, um, you're off. After eight hours, so, so let's say like like one thirty ish, you're off, and then the other set probably comes like around one, all the way to like I don't know, or I don't know how it works to be honest. Okay, but um whatever. So yeah, and then the main the main thing for me is that I want to be home by the time my husband gets home because we barely have time together, you know. And then like I I don't want to work weekends. I don't want to like really leave him off just hanging. Like I I don't want to just drop him off. I don't know, like, I don't know, I feel, I don't feel okay doing that. Like, I want to be with him because, 
I mean, I know at daycare he's not gonna be with me, but I know I'll be in the same building. If anything happens, I just gotta run, okay? That's it. Like, I don't wanna go to the car, drive. No, I, you know, like, I'm literally, like, with him, kind of, basically. So I'm hoping to get the job. I've heard, like, a really long process, but um, it's worth it. It's really worth it. So I'm gonna try really, really, really hard. Also, I wanna get a car at the dealership, you guys. For Like, for me, I, I wanna get a truck, dude, but, dude, trucks are fucking expensive. And, um, yeah, that's, that's, that's what I want to do. I told my husband, I was like, would you help me, pay, um, get a truck? And he said, if you make the payments every month, I'll help you, like, you know, get it out. I was like, okay, I can do that. So I really do need a good-ass job, like, because, uh, or I don't know, I might just get a small car, because, you know, I'm broke. Or not broke, but not rich either. Like, I, I don't think I can afford a truck yet. But I do want a truck because they come like in handy and stuff. So hopefully, but um, yeah, that this is it for today's video. Um, I hope you guys have a good day and <sighs> thank you guys for your support. Seriously. Um, also, when I get a car, I'm gonna be going out more and stuff. I'm gonna be doing more stuff, so it'll be funner. I'll probably upload more videos like than than just sitting here at home because I literally don't really have much to do or show here. But if I go out and explore, then I have more adventures to show you guys. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Thank you for the support. Seriously, like, like I don't know, like, it feels good to know that there's people that actually like to watch my videos. Honestly, I feel so happy. No, but yeah, I'm, I'm planning a prank on my husband. So stay tuned, you guys. Alright guys, see you guys next time. Bye! Diles, bye!